Hello, this is Lego Studios 9083, and I went to Five Below recently and picked up this um, cheaper version of Lego. It is made by Crazy Art, or Rose Art, right there. And it's a Super Block set. Just move that out of the way so I can show you. And I got it at Five Below for five dollars and I picked up three of these and it says a uh, guaranteed quality believe it or not I think this is better quality than Mega Bloks the minifigures maybe not but pretty close to Lego actually let me just alright so Mega Bloks brick um, I see if I can find a Lego brick. Because I have a mixture of all. Uh, let's see, one second. Um, any type of Lego? Still Mega Blocks. Alright, well, all I could find was this. So, I just got a base plate right here. Alright. Well, obviously, Lego has the best quality brick, but Lego, Mega Box. Mega Box is really hard to build and put together and take apart, and Lego is very easy. It fits perfectly and stuff. So, let me just take a piece off of here to show you. I think the quality is better than better than Mega Box. So here's the Super Blocks, Lego, Mega Blocks. Mega Blocks is not really that compatible compatible with Lego. It is in some cases, but in others it's really hard to get off. Lego is obviously compatible with other Lego. Sometimes Mega Blocks isn't. And Super Blocks is actually pretty close to Lego, so I'm happy about that. And I picked up the uh, Hovercraft set. Like I said, it was $5 at 5 below. I think this set is totally worth it. It's very cool. So, it is a 2-in-1 model, just like Lego Creator. You could also build what looks like a... Um, Land speeder from Star Wars or something. You get one minifigure and it's just showing all the features. And I think it's totally worth it for five dollars. The only thing I can complain about is the wheels on this set. They're like plastic. And the stickers could be better because they're like somewhat peeling off a little bit. Alright. Start off with your only minifigure. It could be a pilot of some sort. And uh, you could see it in my friend's Rose Art Sucks video. And he made that like, because the heads are hollow like that. So he was like, Where's the Rose Art guy? I don't know. We gotta find him to put out the fire. They start filling his head with water and throwing him. Throwing the water into the fire. But, um, many figures could be better. <sighs> Sorry. Might sound like I was a little constipated there. I was trying to get the legs off. So, somewhat close to a Lego figure. And, I want to see if the legs work with the uh, Lego. They do not, Lego legs do not work with him. Let's see if his legs work with a Lego figure. Nope. Too big. Alright, so. He only has printing on one side. Just put the box back over there. He has printing on one side. Very nice printing, though. 
So that's your minifigure. And now onto the set. The only complaint I have with uh, the pieces of the set is I was missing one for the joystick. And you do get an extra red light piece and one of those. So I put a little control panel on the inside. The cockpit does open up. Let me get the directions to show you those if you're not familiar with these. Uh, they're not even in here, but um, sorry. <laughs> um, this whole entire middle part here is hollow. If I could. That part's hollow there. And let me just put this back on. One second. Alright. But, uh, cockpit opens up. The minifigures are hard to put in. Uh, just take my control panel out. There would be a joystick right there, if you could see. But, um, can fit them in. Lean him back and then put his hands down like that. Fits in very nicely. With a lot of room to spare. It's a, does the lights go up any higher? I just want to see. Uh, no, not really. Um, so, that's the cockpit. And the set does have some very nice hinge pieces. Gotta put the engine. Alright. There is a hinge piece for the engine right here. Two of them, one on each side. And the engines turn like this. Because it is a hovercraft. Take off. Put the engines forward and. But, um, they are very nice quality pieces. I'd say almost better mega blocks. Oh, the engines do fall off sometimes. Um, you got a sticker here, 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 and here, and on the front, right there. But um. On a flat surface, this does roll very good. I just find something. <laughs> I'll get my laptop. <laughs> Alright. So, it does roll very nicely. On a flat surface. Some of you in the comments are probably going to be like, oh, Laptop abuse! <laughs> I can imagine somebody doing that, so... <laughs> I'm getting a new one because I'm joining the uh, Landroids group. And no, not steroids, Landroids. <laughs> um, so I need the NXT robot. I will be doing a review of that if I do build it. So, I just put my laptop back over there. But, um, I will? Maybe. Not definitely, maybe. <laughs>